Hello everybody, in this video I'm going to show you how to use DirectX 12 Resident Evil 2 Remake. Okay, first you need to check if your computer can even run DirectX 12. So click on search, type in run, type in DXDIAG, press enter. This will bring up the DirectX diagnostic tool. On the very bottom you can see DirectX version, but on the top you're going to see a tab that says display. Click on that. On the right hand side under feature levels, you're going to see a bunch of numbers. If the numbers are 12 underscore zero and above, that means you can probably run DirectX 12. Okay, if you don't see this, then you probably cannot run it. Okay, if you can run it, what you want to do is update Windows. DirectX 12 is installed on the Windows update automatically. Go to settings, go to Windows update, check for updates to see if there are any updates, then install them. You can also force install. I'll put a URL in the video description below, but you can click on it, click here and download it and install it manually. Okay, after you've done that, you need to access the graphic settings after launching the game. Go to options, graphics, and look for DirectX version and select DirectX version 12 if available. And uh, once you have done it, verify it's active. Return to the graphics menu and confirm that DirectX 12 is enabled. And that is it. That is how you enable DirectX 12 on Windows.